We have got a new car. You know me is driving a new Ford Fiesta. Monty. It's called Monty or Montgomery, is that right? Yeah. The great thing about this car is that I've got enough room to vlog in it. Have you? Yeah. I could get my whole head in it and that. So uh, we're going to Redgate today because it's a Saturday and it's kind of mild kind of today for winter and stuff so we're going to red care and we're going to go chill out on the beach uh, well, even though it'll be chill freezing out. we're literally going to chill out on the beach because it's freezing we need to work out how to get there though because we're currently in no signal where we are So we've been to Redka and we're back in the car again. Um, you should have seen some jump shots or some slides or some video clips of what we were doing. Um, honestly, I've never been here before, so I didn't know what to expect, but there wasn't really much. It was a nice t seaside town. Um, and yeah, it had a nice seaside. It reminds me a lot like Blackpool, like, but not as good in Bridlington, but a bit better than Bridlington. So it's actually quite, it was actually all right. Very cold, um, we've got fish and chips and we've got like this huge amount of ice cream, this unbelievable amount of ice cream from the ice cream shop. Uh, we have like literally like a bucket of ice cream. So we didn't eat all that. Then we went on the high streets, just had a look around and stuff and that was cool, just seeing all the different shops. And it's sad because unemployment around here is, you can just tell, and I hate going to places where you can just tell that there's so much unemployment going on. Um, but people need jobs and the system's failing people so you know it's really sad to see and it was saying you know Naomi was saying that it makes her sad seeing this place um, or some parts of this place and you know it's just really strange you get the Argos's and all these different shops here Peacock's uh, three all these shops but then you never really hear his name you never really see any uh, small shops getting any business so here's Naomi coming in well in a second and we're gonna go ahead back to Richmond and chill out for a bit hello good morning it is Monday morning back to work today and I'm actually vlogging for once in my life when I should be so this weekend uh, I've been vlogging as you can see I went to Redka and then we went to church and stuff yesterday so I didn't really vlog then um, so we went to Redka on Saturday and I said the day before on uh, on the Friday I did do a vlog and I put it up on my YouTube channel but then it cut off halfway through so I don't know why it's just the YouTube upload editor because I filmed it all on my phone and now I'm filming it with the proper uh, PowerShot vlogging camera so today I'm just going to take you about with this camera and show you a day in my life and it's going to be a bit more normal than the one that I put out on Friday because on Friday I spoke at two different places one online at a conference in, or in a, a, like a big conference in uh, India called Plinth Conference for Universities and we had quite a few people listening in on my story then on the night of Friday on Friday night I spoke at uh, our Elevate Youth Ministries meeting at our church because um, our youth pastor was ill and he couldn't do it so that was a busy day so today it's gonna be a bit easier because I'm just doing a lot of computer work um, I'm going to update my portfolio and I'm going to go ahead and what else? Uh, do my tax return uh, because I haven't done that yet and I need to do it this week otherwise I'll get told off. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing today and it's going to be, hopefully it's going to be a good day for it and then I might go for a walk at lunchtime because I need to start walking more often and then I think I've just got blog posts to do. I need to like bring out Creative Bar. If you noticed, that it's hard to bring out creative bar in the morning because I never have the thumbnail finished until like I get back to the office on Monday morning so just bear with me as creative bar is being made because I want to make creative bar good and stuff but the only way for me to do that is by you know spending time on it I'm in the talks with people about doing some uh, motion graphics for uh, creative bar like the intro and stuff and creating a thumbnail um, procedure so we're gonna have some good thumbnails and everything else and I'm even in talks with myself about creating a new channel for it because I think it, it 
I don't know what I want to do with that, but let me know your thoughts down below if you want me to create new channels for different things. Uh, because I don't want to like force feed you guys anything you don't want to see, but at the same time, I don't want to make you go subscribe to another channel because I've already got two. So anyway, I'm going to go and head up to my office now and get ready for work and start this day off in style. So I'm in my office now, I'm starting work, I actually started two hours ago, it's nearly 11 o'clock, it's 5 to 11 right now, but um, I'm just looking at YouTube videos, I've put up Creative Bar, good comments straight away, I really like the fact that you guys like Creative Bar because it's a project that me and Yomi love doing and we want to see it grow uh, in the next few years, but I'm going to be thinking about doing this blog post. I've already said I would, but I'm going to do a blog post about some of the gear that I use. And I'm wondering whether I put a video out to make it easier or whether I just do a blog post. Because um, to be honest, I think it's the age old question, like for me anyway, which is what is my YouTube channel about and what do I put up there? I sort of do a mix between graphic design videos or like, you know, business videos um, and en encouraging videos or videos of encouragement. I'm not too sure. So, um, yeah, and also we've got like this beep outside my office uh, and it's like an alarm system that needs to be uh, fixed or some guy needs to come out and fix it. So I'll have to wait for that before I film anything today. But I've got quite a busy day today. I've got to work out how much I've earned and everything uh, over this past year. And I know I should have done it ages ago, even before I was married, but I didn't. So I've waited to the last minute and I'm doing it now. But what else was I going to say? I'm doing some preparation for the hand lettering course, which I'm going to start filming next week, and it's going to be out in April, which is what I'm really looking forward to. And um, if you didn't know, I'm a hand letterer and logo designer, and I like to show you guys how I do that by making courses and selling it to you. So uh, if you're interested in taking part in this hand lettering course, it's going to be an extensive course. Um, that I'm putting together and it's my personal way of doing hand lettering which works for me and like many other people then go ahead and the link is in the description which you can sign up and when it's live you'll get 50% off the course and an email notification for when it's live so it's a win-win situation at the minute I'm going to go ahead and finish off some of these emails do some of this work that I need to do and um, I'm not too sure we'll just have to take it from there really let me just say this pocket three mint tea is like the nicest tea ever like i'm obsessed with it over these past couple of days i've been obsessed with this pucker tea it's so strong of mint three mint tea gotta have some and here's my coffee mug some of you guys ask about my coffee mug and what i do um and this is like a weird insulating coffee mug so it's like glass within glass it's really strange so it's the middle of the day and i've just had lunch earlier on and I'm making another coffee in one of these cool mugs again. We've got this Tasman machine which I keep banging on about but it works really well. I've just been doing mock-ups and stuff this afternoon um, and stuff like that because that's what I needed to do and I'm sort of procrastinating between doing that and email stuff that I need to do because there's some stuff that I really need to do like emails uh, got on with my course guidelines and stuff, but I don't do it because I just find it boring and you know I will do it. It's just like I don't want to do it right now this second or today I also just remembered I'm in the spare room at the minute. Here's a nice little backdrop for us, isn't it? Um, I also remember that I need to film a video today as well an actual vlog, but I'm not too sure In what to film it on now the problem that I have Can you hear that? It's horrible noise. How can anyone sleep in here? cat's sleeping here but um yeah so basically i want to film a vlog but i don't know what to film on because lately i've been having trouble of like identifying what videos i want to do now as you guys know in my channel on my main channel it's not just a design exclusive channel and i'm not making another channel to talk about graphic design or anything like that you know it's my job you can follow me on instagram you can see my stuff and that get courses, look at all that. I talk about it a little bit, but I'm talking about encouraging things at the minute because um, I don't want to limit what I can impart to you guys by just doing design stuff. Um, so I'm going to try and work out some interesting videos that I can do on my channel, whether it is stuff of my work, maybe not me just talking about it, but a lot of projects like The Great Designer or there's lettering projects that I've done before. I'm not too sure, but I really want to get into doing some more stuff like that and really get into more 
I don't know, just encouraging words for you guys like I do in my normal vlogs. I mean, having the vlogging camera like this is way easier to talk to you guys, but I like to do mine in pretty good production when I'm on the main camera. So let me know what you think. I, I'm not too sure. Um, I, I really want to create content that you guys enjoy, but I also want to create content that I enjoy, so we have to like compromise and work together. Um, and you know, people won't like that, but at the end of the day, if you're the guys creating the content, then that's it. And I think the alarm guy's here. So I totally realized I never sort of ended the vlog, but it's okay because it's Friday and I'm going to edit the vlog from this week today. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I'm going to go and have some lunch, or not lunch, breakfast and whatever spoons to start off my day. Have a good one.